Uh, really just deciding uh, which school to actually go to because all of my top five actually I felt really comfortable with, but I mean it was the toughest decision in my life really, and that was it. Well, what thoughts were going through your head when you actually sit there and actually sign the paper and you know it's done, it's over, I'm set? Uh, I'm j I was just real excited to sign and get it over with. Uh, I've been waiting for this day to come, and uh, I just thank everybody who's who's uh, got me here. What do you think of the potential for the team could be moving forward? Obviously, shooting's a need. Mm -hmm. They got you and Robert and Max, three shooters yeah. coming in. What do you think you guys could be like next year and moving forward? Uh, I feel like the guys they have there are real good, and uh, – I think that they do need some shooters, so the guys that have committed in my class, I think that we can make a big impact, and also uh, I can make a big impact myself. What, uh, how do you envision your role? Uh, just doing whatever Coach Cream wants me to do, really. He's basically told me that uh, I'll, I'll have to do a lot, and I'm going to work hard to be able to do the best that I can there, and uh, hopefully I can do, do a great deal for Indiana. What's the reception been like? I know it seemed like uh, after you made your decision, your Twitter blew up. Just, <laughs> what, 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 what's, the, what's the reception been like from, from just fans around the state? I mean, really, the reception through the whole process was crazy. Uh, just uh, people from every school, and uh, it was just a real hard decision. But I knew that Indiana fans, and I think that uh, I can do a lot for Indiana and the Indiana fans, too. James, what's, what's this like for you, just a day like this, when, when you see you know your oldest actually sign his letter of intent? Something you've gone through, you understand the process. Yeah, um, it's a big relief for myself and his mom. Um, we realized that uh, James really worked hard from day one to try to make his dreams come to reality. When we sit here today and, and watch him sign his letter of intent, it, it makes everything worthwhile. All the time that he put in and all the hard work, and um, it paid off for him. What advice were you giving on the last couple of guys? <laughs> um, we, we just basically uh, wanted him to make the right decision. Um, when he decommitted, uh, to give him an opportunity to visit other schools, uh, th this had to come from him. And um, we just wanted him to be comfortable. I really believe that uh, Indiana, the relationship that he built early in his career, um, it was overwhelming. And um, the teammates that they have, there now, I thought that they embraced him, and you know, so all those things were played a big important role. And James, what uh, we're talking a lot about college on a day like this. You got a senior year of high school left. What do you want to accomplish? And what are your thoughts about having a shot at Mr. Basketball? Uh, really, just accomplish uh, all the hype I've been getting. Just uh, be able to live up to those expectations, really, and just do what I can for my team, and just really go as far as we can and try to get a state title. And uh, I mean, if I win Mr. Basketball, that would be great, too. James, getting the opportunity to at least explore other schools, what did that do for you in your final decision? Uh, really, I think it was a great part because I never really would have actually known uh, how much I appreciated Indiana, and I think that they appreciate me a lot, too. So just looking around and just uh, seeing how they compared to each other, I think that had a great deal in it. Their commitment to you, uh, how much did that play into your final decision to stick with them? Yeah, I really I really saw it, uh, how the coaches, they just basically said that they need me there and that I would be able to do a lot there. And uh, I think that I would have been able to do a lot at any other schools too, but I think it would mean a lot more at Indiana. I know you're a, a humble guy, but your commitment to this incoming recruiting class for them, what do you think it does for that class as a whole? Uh, I think that I can do a lot, but I think the other commits can do a lot too. And I think that all of us together uh, will bring a big impact into Indiana University.